Okay, the 1978 Invasion of the Body Snatchers. Again, I covered it last year and I noticed quite a lot in it. Um, but now it's really, really making sense. Okay, so this is the Arrow Special Edition. Watch out, they'll get you while you're sleeping. Take it literally. The awake versus the asleep, right? So if you're unawake, you'll get shot, right? If you're awake, you won't. It also says, um, what happens when you can no longer trust not just the authorities, but even your nearest and dearest? Anyway, in the uh, special booklet that comes with it, here's Spock. Uh, here we go, Psychic Plague. Does it ring any bells? The word plague and psychological. Yeah? Now, the film itself. Spock says, oh, it's, a, it's like a flu. Now, I, I covered that before. I'd forgotten that he actually said it. I mean, how obvious is that? It's like a flu. I mean, this film is phase two. What we're in. It is, completely, and it's, it's about as important as The Wizard of Oz. The um, opening scene is a truck with a number 23 on it, may as well mention it. It's a West Coast setting, San Fran. He goes to Chinatown. Ring any bells? Okay, I've written the awake versus asleep. Um, Veronica Cartwright, I think, yeah, she says, oh, you know, this, this spore, this... This plant could get into us and change our DNA. And what have they been saying about this mRNA shot? Hmm? Right, hold on. Yeah, they walk amongst the, the shot people unnoticed as long as they act like zombies, or unawake. Right. Um, the final scene, uh, let's see if I can find uh, Mr. Sutherland. There's the old Adams. See, West Coast setting. There it is. Okay, the final scene is somebody who's been taken over, him. Right? One, he's been shot. And he's pointing out one of the awake, Veronica Cartwright. Selling, selling her out. Yeah? That's the next level, isn't it? The unawake shot people selling out the awake you've already seen that right i've already explained that to you you know sitting there amongst all those sh unawake shot people and they're all you know like <sighs> resentment and oh what did i do you know but it's sort of like verbal hand grenades coming across you know the next level is is the end of this movie where they're just uh pointing the finger and getting you in trouble etc. I mean, look, there it is again. What happens when you can no longer trust not just the authorities, but even your nearest and dearest. And there he is at the end, doing exactly that. So, West Coast setting goes to Chinatown. Spock mentions the, uh, the flu. Oh, it's like a flu. Oh, and yeah, he also, in the key scene when um, Adam's says um she says oh it's a nightmare it's everyone on the whole city has changed overnight and then it, it pans to a tram with 113 on it uh, and then he sutherland covers up his nose and mouth and i mentioned that before in my previous video last year and he holds it there for a while covering up his nose and mouth oh it's the flu yeah so it's all there and it's subtle. All the predictive programming in the 70s was subtle. But it was, it was there all the way through. And this one, this one is, is, I mean, this is one creepy movie. Creepy. And it's, it's this and, and it's so insidious. Um, what else is there? Um... No, it's got all the elements. It's got China, it's got uh, West Coast of America, 
flu, covering up his nose and mouth, um, the awake versus the unawake, get you while you're unawake. Yeah. Nasty stuff. I'll probably find some more in there. Psychic plague. Oh, that's a good one. There it is. Psychological warfare. Psychic plague. Yeah, broadcast. Yeah. Anyway, that's that. I'll, I'll cut that one there. But this this movie is like super important. Yeah, I'm, I'm bound to find more in it, but, but yeah, it's, it's broad strokes. The shot versus the, the awake non-shot. And that line, mRNA vaccine. Ooh. And of course they've been saying something like that, haven't they? I say that the, the government reports are saying, oh, we don't know what the second shot does. We're waiting on the, on the feedback amongst the guinea pigs, and you know who they are. <laughs>